Today we'll visit H area, which is at the heart of the unique capabilities offered at the Savannah Riverside. H Canyon and its adjoining HB line facility represent the last full-scale radiochemical processing capabilities left in the United States. It can be said that H area is a national treasure. The work that goes on is unique and has far-reaching significance. H Canyon began operations in 1955, and for nearly 40 years, the facility recovered isotopes from aluminum-clad enriched uranium fuel that was irradiated in the site's nuclear production reactors and other domestic and foreign research reactors. Using a chemical separations process, the H Canyon, and later HB Line, extracted isotopes for use in our nation's defense and deep space exploration. Since the end of the Cold War, operations in the H area complex were dedicated to stabilizing and managing most of the inventory of highly enriched uranium materials at SRS. Today, H Canyon stands as the only large-scale shielded radiochemical facility in the U.S. and is currently participating in a highly enriched uranium blend-down campaign that converts the HEU, or highly enriched uranium, extracted from used or spent nuclear fuel received from L-area to low enriched uranium, eliminating the risk of diversion in a nuclear weapon. This LEU is no longer weapons usable and will be used to make fuel for use in the Tennessee Valley Authority power reactors to generate electricity. DOE has requested us to perform two primary missions. The first mission is to recover uranium from spent nuclear fuel. This material ultimately will be blended with natural uranium to make commercial fuel, and that will be run in the Tennessee Valley authorities. Uh, to date, we have delivered 301 metric tons of this material, and that's enough inherent energy to power all the houses in the state of South Carolina for the next 10 years. Uh, the work we have to do will produce similar results. Our second mission is to support HB Line to make feed for the MOX facility. Uh, we'll dissolve plutonium material that is currently stored on site. That material will be processed through HB line to make inspect material that would ultimately be delivered to the MOX facility. In the end, both of these missions really make the world a safer and brighter place to be. Working in tandem with H Canyon is the HB line. Located on top of the canyon, the HB line is the only chemical processing facility of its kind in the Department of Energy complex. The HB line finishes what is dissolved and separated in the canyon. Currently, it has been upgraded to support the production of plutonium oxide, feed material for the mixed oxide facility, or final disposition. This mission is called Alternate Feedstock 2, or AFS2. The process consists of converting plutonium material that is stored in K area into an oxide that meets the specifications of the MOX facility. The plutonium is dissolved in H Canyon. The resultant nitrate solution is chemically purified and ultimately converted into plutonium oxide in HB line phase two and returned to storage in K area until MOX is ready to receive the oxide, where it will be used in the manufacture of commercial nuclear reactor fuel. H area's work is extremely significant, not only for this site, but also for this country and quite frankly, the world. Uh, we're in the business of rendering materials safe, not only for this lifetime, but also, you know, really for the uh, security of this country for the years to come. If we look at the, our, our mission here is to take materials that have been stored in K area and L area and, and disposition those into safe forms, either forms in the, in the case of uh, uh, uranium into low enriched uranium that can be used in commercial reactors. As, as well as plutonium, we actually are converting plutonium into plutonium oxide materials that could be burned potentially as a MOX fuel in reactors, but also dispositioned in, in a safe form and a waste form in the future. So it's renting materials safer for our country and for future generations. I'll tell you why H Canyon matters. We are taking all this legacy material that we don't want out in the world anymore, and we are turning it into power. You know, my job matters because at the end of the Cold War, we have a lot of excess material that the country now has to deal with. And HP Line is in the middle of helping the, the country uh, dispose of that and put it into a safe form. That's why my job matters. Weapons to plowshares. I'm real proud of the site being located in South Carolina and the uh, fact that we're doing something that is done very few places around the world and it's making the world a safer place. Absolutely keeps the world safe.
thanks to the commitment and capabilities of H area personnel and the unique nature of the facilities, the H Canyon has been able to adapt over the years and stabilize a wide variety of materials into forms that can be reused or secured for safe, permanent disposal. When coupled with the scientific and technical capability at the Savannah River National Lab and the talented engineering and operations forces in H area, H Canyon and its adjoining HB line has the ability to manage nuclear materials and serve the United States and the world for many years to come. I hope you enjoyed your visit with the people and facilities of H area and have a better sense of the capabilities of HB line and H Canyon. Just one more reason why the Savannah River site matters.